Yo, what up, son? It's your boy, ZDog MD. Contrary to popular belief, I am an actual doctor, which means when I see something on Facebook that says frozen lemon more powerful than chemotherapy, I go, what? I need to investigate this, especially since this video posted by Organic Wellness or at The Organic Wellness on Facebook, because I want you to go there and let them know what you think, ZPAC. When I see that and it has 15 million views, I go, hmm. I ought to figure out whether this is going to lead people to do things like avoid real chemotherapy when they need it for cancer and instead eat a frozen grated lemon. This is the video in question. So it's one of these classic things where it's just text, pictures of various lemons and people eating lemons, and uh, it's got 15 million views. And this is what it basically does. It starts out with this cool thing. You can freeze a lemon grate the hell out of it, and put it in shit and eat it. That's dope. I would watch that 15 million times. Unfortunately, it gets real after that. Because then it starts saying, oh, yo, did you know that um, organic wellness says that the compounds found in lemon peels are a thousand times more powerful than adriamycin, a drug commonly used in chemotherapy. Now, z -Pack, those of us in the healthcare profession know adriamycin as a cytotoxic chemotherapy, th chemotherapeutic agent, often used in combination with other agents to treat cancer under the spe uh, specialized supervision of an oncologist. That stuff can work for cancer. Is a lemon thousands of times more powerful than adriamycin? Uh, no. Simply no, because they go on to say, but more importantly, the lemon peels only act on the malignant cells, destroying them while leaving behind the healthy cells without damaging them. Oh my gosh, that sounds like magic. Okay, this is what's going on. There have been studies over the years looking at components of citrus fruit, which includes lemons, and there are limonoids and different sub uh, uh, compounds within lemons that have some anti-tumor activity in laboratory models, either animals or petri dishes. It has never been shown to be thousands of times more powerful than any chemotherapeutic agent because it hasn't been looked at like that. It has never been shown to work in humans or has been studied in humans for anti-cancer potential. We have no idea what the dose is. We have no idea what the concentrations are. When you see a video like this that claims that something natural can cure cancer better than chemotherapy, always question what the fuck. And this is one of those ex classic examples. Although lemons are full of compounds, as are many fruits, vegetables, and, and natural foods, full of compounds that have anti-cancer properties in vitro, in glass, in the lab, we have no sense how this actually applies to a functioning human being. So, so why does it even matter? Okay, well, first of all, when you have a video that has 15 million views that makes claims that this particular natural way of... Uh, uh, grinding up a lemon and eating it can cure cancer, then people have the danger of foregoing seeing an actual oncologist when they have cancer. People who have had chemotherapy or going through it go, oh, did I really need this very toxic stuff when I could have just ground up a lemon and then guilt and regret and unhappiness? All for what? For lies! There is no evidence that this does anything in a real world situation to cure or prevent cancer. Now, we need to study natural compounds more, and if we can pull out limonoids or whatever individual compounds in uh, lemons that have shown some promise, then don't you think the pharmaceutical manufacturers are gonna take those and create a drug and charge a ton of money for it to try to treat cancer? Yes, they are. So believe me, people work on this stuff. Believe me also, freezing a lemon and using it to cure your cancer is officially bullshit. You know how you also know that this video is crap? Just keep watching it. If It says, if this wasn't enough, lemon peels alkalinize, by the way, they spell it wrong. They spell alkalize, which is not a word, Tom Heineber. Alkalize your body and regulate the blood's pH values, promoting optimal health. But Z, is it gonna mess with my alkaline water? Because I love that stuff. The thing is, if you was alkaline all the time, then you wouldn't have the cancers. Autism. Wouldn't even get it.
Guys, here's the thing. The blood has a natural buffer system that regulates your pH. Eating lemons does almost nothing to your blood pH. And if it did, it would not alkalize it, which is not a word, or alkalinize it. Lemons contain a lot of citric acid, which is an acid. So already, lies. All right. And then the last one, they also regulate your blood pressure, have antidepressant effects, and eliminate feelings of anxiety and irritability. I don't know. I'm pretty anxious and irritable right now just reading about it, to be honest. So bottom line, ZPAC, I want you to share this video with all the idiots who have shared this lemon video with you. Idiots. Idiots. And I want you to tell them, hey, you know what? Listen, eat lemons. They're good for you. Freeze them, grate them up, put them on stuff. They have vitamin C. They have vitamin B6. They have lots of different flavonoids and limonoids that may be helpful to your health. You can prevent a lot of illness just by eating healthy, exercising, living a good lifestyle, not smoking. This is all true. You are not going to cure cancer by grinding up a lemon and giving it to people. And this, uh, this statement of, uh, oh, it only kills cancer cells, but it doesn't actually affect the um, other tissues in the body. Uh, they're making this ish up. So don't listen to them. And if you look at the comments on the video, you'll see that someone who had gone through chemotherapy sarcastically writes in. And the organic wellness people write back and go, well, it's not proven, but it's shown success in lots of trials. Well, then why are you saying this? Why are you spreading this crap? Okay. Our mission, ZPAC, at Incident Report here on the show is to spread truth, debunk crap, and let our patients and other healthcare providers know that we are on the side of truth and wisdom. So hit share, hit like, share the show, follow, and what do y'all think? Are we out or what? Listen, you may be a stupid moron on the internet who believes that lemons can cure cancer, but we're just not going to let you die, you stupid idiot piece of junk. I wouldn't have really phrased it that way, but um, I like what you're, I like, I like the sentiment. I like the sentiment. What up, ZPAC? We out. Peace. You are really dumb. For real. No. For real. No. So dumb. Maybe. He's so lemony, dumb. but he saves. He's lemony, but he saves. <laughs> <laughs> we out.